Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be talking about one of the most hotly debated topics inside of Google Ads, and that is the Google Ads certification. Now, I'm going to walk you through what this is, what it's used for, essentially why a lot of people dislike it, and essentially go over what I think of it as well, because my opinion is by far the most important opinion on the subject, clearly, and that is complete sarcasm. I hope you all understand that. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to co cover essentially everything on this and go over my thoughts, go over other people's thoughts, and really what this should be used used for if you should get it and is it a complete dumpster fire or is this thing actually kind of good and you should check it out and maybe get your own certification with it. So let's get into it. So to start off, what is the Google Ads certification? And the Google Ads certification is a certification brought to you by Google. And essentially Google created this certification program to essentially teach people how to run Google ads because a lot of people weren't doing it correctly. And the developers were like, we got to do something about this because a lot of people are losing money and we need to make sure people gain a lot, at least a little bit of money. So they stay on the actual site and keep spending money so we can make more money. And that's how this kind of went about. And uh, Google ads did an actually really good job when designing this. I think it is very well thought out. I think it provides amazing examples. I think it gives you an amazing framework to actually work inside of Google ads most people will automatically criticize this because you can essentially cheat your way through this. You can go online, you can look up all the answers and get certified within probably a couple hours on all the different actual certifications here. I'm going to go over those in a second. But that I think is a really unjust criticism because this is completely free. And if you want to cheat your way through anything, you pretty much can for the most part. This is completely free. It's an amazing framework. There's so much information. And if you're brand new to Google ads, I don't think there's a better starting place than this. A lot of the courses that uh, I've done and that I've known about essentially drop you into the deep end of the actual water. They assume you know what we're talking about. Even my course does that as well. I assume people have at least a basic knowledge of how to run uh, Google ads or how to at least create an account with Google ads and the certification course. It doesn't assume that it starts you off from the absolute bare bones, then it works your way up and essentially goes over everything in the account. It goes over audiences, goes over bid strategies, goes over dynamic keyword insertion, goes over everything. And really, this is just an amazing way to learn Google ads, at least at the beginning. And then from there, you can actually start and kind of maneuver your way into what you want to learn more about. Maybe you want to go into display ads. And then from there, you could learn about display ads, maybe through a free YouTube course or online. Maybe there's a free online course. I don't know. Maybe you can take a paid course and just kind of gather more and more and more stuff about that. That's normally what I would recommend doing for at least learning Google ads. That's how I learned it. I focused on the lead generation side of this. I took a whole bunch of free courses. I took a whole bunch of paid courses and then kept learning and learning and learning and through experience and through the Google ads certification program, you kind of build a nice little framework of how this particular side of Google ads works. And there's a lot of different sides like Google ads, there's display, YouTube, Google analytics, there's just so much behind this. And uh, I don't really think someone could be super well versed in all of them. So I highly recommend kind of niching down and picking one. If you're really good at display ads, or you're really good at YouTube ads, that's what you should do. That's what you should focus on, because there's just so much there. That's something I really recommend for a lot of people. Because if you're new to this, it does take a lot to actually get going and figuring stuff out and kind of wrapping your brain about this. That That's what I would do at least. Now coming through here, what are the actual certifications? How many are there? And there's quite a few you have the actual measurement, which is essentially how to optimize, look at things, diagnose and access uh, all of the actual things running in your account. Now, I don't think this is actually the best way to optimize your account, but it does give you kind of a framework on how to do it, which is better than nothing, in my opinion. So that's something that's cool. Google Ads search that's running you through all the actual development and managing and optimizing of the search campaigns, which is really cool. Uh, I would say there's probably more than an hour and a half of content um, that you can find just free online compared to this actual certification course. There's a lot to search campaigns and they've been around forever. And the amount of stuff you can learn about them is just almost Almost endless here and just the amount of scenarios lead generation versus e-commerce versus you know trying to get email signups versus all the other stuff inside of google ads there's just so many different sides of search campaigns and of course they can't walk you through everything here but they can do a good job just allowing you to understand the basics and that's really what this certification is for when it comes to ai powered we're talking about performance max campaigns we're talking about how ai works we're talking about essentially all of the amazing things google is doing right now and i don't really think it's at a great stage yet i think it's at a very good stage i think this will get 
better. And I think this is something to definitely take a look at if you're new, because this is going to be the way of the future for Google Ads, at least in my opinion. We're probably going to be moving to performance max campaigns uh, not too far into the future, but making sure you can actually have good attribution, making sure that the leads you get, at least for lead generation, are of high quality. That's something that still is a really big factor in why a lot of companies will go with a search campaign, which has less AI and is more work, but delivers better quality leads as opposed to performance max campaigns, which almost every e commerce company I see now is really picking those just because it is so good at getting really cheap sales. The next one is the actual creative. So if you've done any video display or apps, you got to create pictures for these, which is a massive thing inside Google ads. And really the AI has not gotten there to the point of automatically generating this stuff. Now it can dynamically take images off your website, but even those images is not really great at picking them. And it has to test a lot to actually figure out which ones are going to work and which ones aren't. And sometimes you don't have a banner ad on your website. So you've got to go and create this. And this is a, another creative certification that really, if you're going to be doing banner ads, YouTube ads, apps, uh, the great place to start start off with as well. Offline sales, that's something that's really being innovated as well, actually taking in a whole bunch of emails and essentially store visits and stuff that people may have saw your ad and then you're going to be essentially using all this data that you get offline to essentially upload to a performance max campaign. And then that's going to optimize and try to figure out, okay, these individuals, maybe they didn't convert online and buy one of our actual products, but they came into a store and did. So now we have to optimize with that and we're going to be uploading data. Another great certification if you're looking how to do that, especially for a lot of like the merchant stores and stuff like that, where you're selling products in store as opposed to online, uh, something to definitely look at uh, when it comes to a second cer search certification. What's the difference? Oh, okay, I guess there's two. Uh, <laughs> okay, there we go. I thought that first search certification was really short. Uh, so essentially, clearly, this is the second one where we're actually going into the development and management and optimization, where this is just the actual uh, original one as well. Display certification, AI powered shopping, video certification, apps. Uh, there's so many certifications here. And like I said, at the beginning of this video, I really think you should figure out what you want to do, kind of focus on that and then go from there. If you want to do video, maybe focus on video. If you're going to do display, you should probably focus on display. You're going to do search, focus on search. There's a lot of stuff to learn here. And as you can see, this course is 3.7 hours and you can learn a whole bunch more than that, uh, especially with the AI stuff. That stuff is very, very complex and you need to spend a lot of time on there. Google ads video also four hours long. So Unless you have a ton of time uh, to do all of this stuff, I would definitely recommend focusing, going from there, and then kind of uh, going your own way. But to sum this all up, is the Google Ads certification worth it? I do believe it is worth it. Every uh, minute spent in here is probably a good return on investment just because you're going to get that framework. I would then, again, take either free courses or paid courses, learn more about your actual industry, go from there, and then learn even more through experience and running for a your own business or for clients or whatever you're going to be doing. That way you can really build that actual framework inside of your own head of how to run a Google ads campaign properly and see some really, really great results. Now, if you are looking to optimize your campaign even further, and this is for search campaigns, by the way, we created a completely free Google ads optimization checklist. Again, completely free link is down below, walks you through on what to do on a weekly, monthly and three month basis. Also lets you jot down your results. So you can see that your account is improving month over month. Now, if you have any comments, questions, or concerns, leave a comment down below. I will do my best to get back to you. Other than that, you guys have a wonderful day. Take care. I wish you all well.